All right, the uh, crank slider is on page 475, 476, maybe 477 in there. Uh, these parts are easy. So uh, and we're going to do them a little differently. Notice instead of uh, having all my parts in one art studio, once I do the base, which is just real simple, you know, it's three circles and two lines, trim them up and extrude it. Then I'm going to, once I'm done with that, I'm going to go click and I'm going to create a different part studio. When you do that, you open up a new part studio and you can create another part. I've already done that, so I'm going to delete this. And so I have a second one where it's the crank. And the crank is, again, it's just a longer version of the base, only with two holes, one at each end instead of just one in the middle. And you can actually, if you look at the next part, the uh, rod, can I move that? There's the rod. It's the same thing, only longer. So when I go here at the crank, I went into that sketch. I did a control C to copy the sketch. And I got out of here. Then I went over to here and I opened a sketch. Went control D and then I just changed the length and I was done. So control C copies, control V pastes. You can probably right click and copy, right click and paste also. And then, or you can just redraw the thing. It's not that hard to do. And then if there is, uh, then there's this piece here. And I forget that. We're going to do that later. Uh, so this is the, um, what do they call it? This is the slider. Uh, these are, and the book is called a CS slider, CS rod, which is crankshaft. You can just use slider, rod, uh, crank, and base. Um, okay, when you get those four parts done, again, don't worry about this one yet. Um, you're going to go to your assembly. You're going to put those four parts in there. And all of these are revolute mates because we want this thing to go like this. Well, we want to control it a little more than that, but get the idea. Now. Got to be that's why, that's why some of these other parts, just to control this a little more. But we don't want the thing to go back and forth. Um, so we're going to make this one to this one. We're going to rev, revolute. I hate that word, but anyway, a revolute mate. Uh, those two are going to be a revolute. And then we're going to get these two way down in the middle to line up as well. And with all these are revolute mates. So um, we got more to do with this. But you get that much done. Make those four parts, get them, get them in an assembly, and then we'll go from there.